Life is simple, but most people insist on making it complicated. And the more you complicate it, the harder and more stressful it becomes. Living that good and unbothered lifestyle shouldn't only be a dream. It can become your reality. And that's what this video is about. Here are five stupid, simple, but efficient life rules. Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Number one, make your bed first thing in the morning. William H. McRaven, a retired U.S. Navy four-star admiral, once famously said, if you want to change the world, start off by making your bed. Making your bed might seem like a small and insignificant task, but it can actually have a big impact on your day. According to psychologist and author Jordan Peterson, making your bed first thing in the morning can set you up for success and improve your overall well-being. For starters, making your bed is a simple act of discipline. By completing this task as soon as you wake up, you're starting your day with a small accomplishment that can give you a sense of pride and motivation to tackle bigger tasks throughout the day. This sense of discipline and accomplishment can carry over into other areas of your life, helping you to develop healthy habits and achieve your goals. In addition to discipline, making your bed can also help to reduce stress and promote a sense of order and control. By taking a few minutes to tidy up your sleeping area, you're creating a visually pleasing and organized space that can help you to reduce clutter and chaos in your mind. This can lead to a greater sense of calm and focus, which can be especially helpful if you're someone who struggles with anxiety or stress. And besides that, making your bed first thing in the morning will remind you that the small things in life matter a lot, and that if you're not able to do the small things right, you're not going to accomplish those big things. Finally, making your bed can also improve your quality of sleep. A neatly made bed is more inviting and comfortable to sleep in, creating a relaxing environment that can help you to fall asleep faster and stay asleep longer. And this can lead to overall better health and well-being as getting enough quality sleep is crucial for our physical and mental health. So there you have it. Making your bed might seem like a small and insignificant task, but it can actually have a big impact on your day and overall well-being. So why not give it a try tomorrow morning and see how it makes you feel? You might just be surprised at the positive impact it'll have on your day. Number two. Understand that hard work beats talent when talent doesn't work hard enough. Many people believe that success is determined solely by one's natural abilities or talents. However, it's important to understand that having talent is only one piece of the puzzle. It takes more than just talent to achieve success in any field or endeavor. Hard work is the key ingredient that sets successful people apart from the rest. It's the drive to persevere, the determination to keep going when things get tough, and the discipline to stay focused on the goal. Hard work means putting in the time, effort, and dedication needed to achieve success. Talent, on the other hand, can only take a person so far. A person might be naturally talented, but if they don't put in the hard work to develop their skills and abilities, they'll never reach their full potential. In fact, it's not uncommon to see people with less talent achieve greater success simply because they worked harder to get there. They wanted it more. Now, one of the main reasons that hard work beats talent is that hard work can make up for a lack of talent. While natural ability can give a person an initial advantage, it's the hard work that allows them to reach their full potential. Hard work can help a person overcome obstacles, learn from failures, and improve their skills and abilities. Another reason why hard work beats talent is that hard work is consistent. Talent can be fickle and unpredictable. A talented person might have a natural ability to perform well in certain areas, but they might also struggle in other areas. Hard work, on the other hand, is something that can be relied upon. A person who works hard consistently will improve over time and ultimately achieve success. So if you want to achieve success, remember that talent is only one piece of the puzzle. To truly reach your full potential, you must be willing to work hard and put in the extra effort needed to succeed. Number three, results matter more than your effort. 
When it comes to achieving success in any endeavor, there's often a debate about whether results or effort matter more. Now, while effort is certainly important and admirable, it is ultimately the results that truly matter. Allow us to explain why. Imagine that you're a student who's just completed a difficult exam. You studied hard for weeks leading up to the exam, putting in countless hours of effort and sacrifice. However, when the grades are posted, you receive a failing grade. In this scenario, your effort might have been commendable, but the result is ultimately what matters. You failed the exam and did not achieve the desired outcome despite your best efforts. Now, let's imagine another scenario. You're a business owner who spent months working on a new product launch. You've poured your heart and soul into this project, working long hours and making many sacrifices along the way. However, when the product is released, it fails to generate any significant revenue or interest. In this case, your effort was certainly admirable, but the result is ultimately what matters. The product launch was not successful and your business did not achieve the desired outcome despite your best efforts. These scenarios illustrate why results matter more than effort. In both cases, the effort put in was significant and commendable, but the ultimate outcome was not achieved. And this is why it's crucial to work smart, not just hard. Working smart means focusing on the tasks and actions that will lead to the desired outcome. It means setting clear goals and objectives and then developing a plan to achieve them. It also means being strategic in your approach and utilizing your resources and strengths to their fullest potential. When you work smart, you're able to achieve results more efficiently and effectively. You're able to avoid wasted effort and focus on the actions that will have the greatest impact. This not only leads to better results, but it also allows you to have more time and energy to dedicate to other important areas of your life. Number four, do your best even when no one is watching. Have you ever heard the saying, character is what you do when no one is watching? Well, it's a simple phrase that holds a hell of a lot of truth. Doing your best when no one is watching is actually really good for you, and here's why. Firstly, when you do your best, even when no one is watching, you're building self-discipline. It's easy to do something well when you know someone is watching or there will be a reward at the end of it. But when no one is watching and there's no tangible reward, it takes true self-discipline to still do your best. This self-discipline will spill over into other areas of your life and help you to achieve other goals. Secondly, doing your best when no one is watching helps you to build a strong sense of integrity. Integrity is about doing the right thing even when it's hard or when no one is watching. When you consistently do your best, you're showing yourself that you've got a strong sense of integrity and that you're committed to doing the right thing no matter what. Thirdly, doing your best when no one is watching helps you to build confidence in yourself. When you know that you've given your all even when no one else is around, you'll feel good about yourself and your abilities. This confidence will definitely help you in other areas of your life as well, such as your career or your relationships. And number five, practice gratefulness. Practicing gratitude is one of the simplest yet most effective ways to improve your well-being and overall quality of life. When you practice gratitude, you shift your focus away from negative thoughts and feelings and instead focus on the positive aspects of your life. This can help you to feel more content, optimistic, and fulfilled even in the face of challenging circumstances. In addition to the emotional benefits, there are also physical benefits to practicing gratitude. Studies have shown that people who regularly practice gratitude experience lower levels of stress, improved quality of sleep, and even a stronger immune system. So why should you practice gratitude? Because it can make a real tangible difference in your life. By taking time to appreciate the good things you have, you can foster a more positive and fulfilling existence. So whether you take a few minutes every day to reflect on the things you're grateful for, or to simply make an effort to appreciate the small moments throughout your day, practicing gratitude is a simple yet powerful way to improve your life.
And that's all for today, Aluxer. We hope you enjoyed watching and learning from this video as much as we did making it. With that being said, we're curious to know what's the one simple but efficient rule that you successfully apply every day? We're always curious to learn and we are certain we can learn something valuable from you as well. And because you're still watching, here's a bonus for you, the true Aluxer. Number six, never lie again. There are many reasons why people will lie, including avoiding punishment, gaining an advantage, or to protect their own interests or ego. However, regardless of the reason, lying often has negative consequences for both the liar and for those around them. When we lie to others, we create a false reality that's disconnected from the truth. We might feel like we are protecting ourselves or others, but in reality, we're just masking the real situation. This disconnection from reality can cause us to lose touch with our own values and beliefs, leading to confusion and inner turmoil. Moreover, when we lie to others, we are essentially denying them the opportunity to make informed decisions based on accurate information. We rob them of the chance to know us fully and form an authentic relationship with us. And this can lead to feelings of guilt and shame, which can further erode our sense of self. In addition, lying creates cycles of mistrust and deception. Once we start lying, it can become harder and harder to keep up the facade, leading us to tell even more lies to cover up the initial one. This cycle of deception can spiral out of control, leaving us feeling trapped and disconnected from those around us. All right, that's the real end of the video. If you found the video helpful, don't forget to tip us with a like and a share for the YouTube algorithm. Thanks for watching, Aluxer. As always, we'll see you back here tomorrow.